Hi everyone! It's repair time again! This time I have a Studio Logic MIDI keyboard controller. The model is SL990 Pro. Let's have a look at the whole thing. Here it is. And something seems to be wrong with it. Let's see what can we do. Here is the power supply for this thing. 9 volts, 500 milliamps, and I can sense a heavy transformer in it, so this seems to be a very simple unregulated supply. I measured 12 volts here, which is ok. And I didn't try to load it, but so far it seems like there is no problem with the supply. So here it is, we plug it in, and the keyboard seems to power up. So, here I have this uh, USB to MIDI adapter, and it can show MIDI activity. Let's plug it into the USB. Here it is, powered up, and there are two LEDs to show MIDI activity. This is marked out, this is marked in, so we need to plug this one into the keyboard's uh, MIDI out. And, as we can see, there is no activity from the keyboard or from the wheels. So, something must be wrong. It was very easy to open this thing up. Just three screws on each side from the bottom to unscrew this plastic part. This is metal, and the bottom is metal. And there are hinges here, but uh, this part is plastic. And there are three standoffs, and as you can see, two of them are broken off. And only one of them was actually holding this side together. And on the other side, one of the standoffs is broken as well. So, let's remove this board and have a look at it. Here is the board, looks quite simple. This is DC input. MIDI output, sustain pedal connector, this is a 5 volt regulator, 3 buttons, uh, microchip uh, PIC 16F74 microcontroller, this is a 74 series chip, some sort of a latch or a buffer, and this is a EE PROM chip to retain some user parameters, I suppose. So, I checked the capacitors using my LCR meter, and they measure perfectly fine. So, I powered it up, and I am using AC and DC mode here, very handy. DC here, and AC here. And uh, here we are, on the power connector. 11 volts, and uh, 130, let's say, millivolts. Ripple, looks fine, and after the regulator, exactly 5 volts, and almost no AC, perfectly fine. I started probing around, and I see that the clock is not running. There is a 12 MHz crystal here. And I'm probing on the capacitors right next to the crystal. And there is low level on one side and high level on the other side. And there is no oscillation. So, if we are lucky, it might be just a crystal that failed. Otherwise, I don't like my chances. So, I temporarily soldered another crystal. And I'm afraid it didn't help. Low level on this side. High level on this side. So I think the microcontroller is dead. And because it has firmware in it, I believe this thing is hopeless. So, unfortunately, no luck this time. Thanks for watching. Bye.